second year student at NCNM. This three minute video is my NWNPC scholarship entry with my topic being neuroinflammation and leaky blood brain barrier. Within the brain there is a special network comprised of a thick basement membrane, astrocyte cell projections, and endothelial cells bound together by tight junctions. The blood brain barrier separates the brain and cerebral spinal fluid from the blood. Transmembrane proteins, including occludin, claudins, or junctional adhesion molecules, make this network 1,000 times less permeable than other capillaries, maintaining a constant environment for the brain. Acting as the traffic cop of the brain, it allows lipid-soluble small molecules, including glucose and insulin, to pass while preventing others. The term leaky gut has become familiar, but the same concept of increased permeability due to inflammation leading to negative manifestations can equally occur in the brain. Systemic inflammation can result in both leaky gut and leaky blood-brain barrier. Microglial cells can activate pro-inflammatory cytokines, IL-1-alpha, IL-1-beta, and TNF-alpha in the central nervous system. Endothelial cells and astrocytes are also capable of producing tumor necrosis factor and interleukins all leading to neuroinflammation and neurodegeneration. Diseases associated with blood-brain barrier compromise include meningitis, brain abscess, epilepsy, Alzheimer's disease, HIV encephalitis, and hypertension, to name a few. So if we were to look into our naturopathic medicine, would we find any solutions here? Studies suggest that botanical medicine may in fact protect against inflammatory brain conditions. Treatment protocols of anti-inflammatories and antioxidants can restore the blood-brain barrier and decrease neurodegeneration. Other natural constituents include catechin from green tea extract, curcumin, rutin containing the flavonoid quercetin, omega-3s acting as a COX-2 inhibitor as well as promoting synthesis of resolvins and protectins, resveratrol, a naturally occurring hydroxystilbene identified in over 70 plant species, apigenin, a flavonoid compound found in celery and parsley, and luteolin, an antioxidant found in celery and green peppers. Treatment efficacy can be determined through a functional test of GABA supplementation, since this is one of the neurotransmitters that should not cross the blood-brain barrier. I hope this informative video has helped show how our medicine can literally change people's minds.